Back to our top story. Some students who had dreams of saving lives say they feel as if their medical career plans have died. They are still reeling from the news that their school, Career Point College, has suddenly shut its doors, both locally and across the country. That's right. Case at 12's Katrina Weber shows us why dozens still showed up at the campus this morning. Even in the dark, it appeared something was afoot at Career Point College. But as the sun came up, there was no doubt. Remember that with the social media and the tweets that your emotions are high. Words of advice for devastated students who came to the wonderland of the Americas campus for answers. We're angry. We are upset. It's people I know that don't even have food to give to their kids. But they want to come to school to better themselves. Kiara Adair heard about Career Point's sudden closing in an email yesterday. It says the school shut down due to tough government funding restrictions brought on by financial aid violations. Something went wrong. Somebody went wrong. Mismanaging money. It's not fair to us. This is ridiculous. I mean, not even a, you know, like just this is going to happen. No advice. No nothing. Just this is it. This is what we got. Closed doors. For many, graduation from the nursing program was supposed to be only two weeks away. For this to happen, it just really turns your life upside down. Aaron De Leon and his girlfriend were in the program together. We already had plans, you know. We were already house hunting, you know. These students may not know what the future holds for them, but they do know at least that tomorrow will bring another gathering like this. They were told to come back then for information. Above all, Remember that we are nurses and we will get through this. Katrina Weber, KSAT 12 News. Right now on our website, you can read the full letter sent to teachers, students, and other faculty and the latest developments on this story. Look for this story on our homepage at KSAT.com.